Lecture number 2 in ASME section 5 for, for API certification exams. This lecture is prepared by Samir Saad. Has experience more than 17 years in oil and gas field. His professional certification more than 26 certificates. ASME authorized inspector, AI, boiler and pressure vessel. ASNT and DT level 3 in 11 methods from ASNT. 5 Weldon fee certifications from AWS. 2 certifications from TWI. 8 certifications from API. In addition lead auditor. Articles 2. Radiographic examination. The inspector should be familiar with and understand the scope of Article 2 and general requirements. The rules for radiography as typically applied on pressure vessels, pipe and eye and tanks such as, but not limited to, required marking, type, selection, number, and placement of IQIs, allowable density, Control of backscatter radiation. Location markers. Records. Scope. The radiographic method described in this article for examination of materials including castings and welds shall be used together with Article 1. General requirements. Backscatter radiation. A lead symbol B with minimum dimensions of half a inch in height and 1 16th inches in thickness shall be attached to the back of each film holder during each exposure to determine if backscatter radiation is exposing the film procedure requirements written procedure radiographic examination shall be performed in accordance with the written procedure each procedure shall include at least the following information, as applicable. Material type and thickness range. Isotope or maximum X-ray voltage used. Source, to object distance. Distance from source side of object to film. Source size. Film brand and designation. Screens used. Continue item T220 General Requirements Procedure Demonstration Demonstration of the Density and Image Quality Indicator IQI, Image requirements of the written procedure on production or technique radiographs shall be considered satisfactory evidence of compliance with that procedure. Excessive Backscatter if a light image of the B appears on a darker background of the radiograph, protection from backscatter is insufficient and the radiograph shall be considered unacceptable. Example of excessive backscatter as shown in the figure below. A dark image of the B on a lighter background is not cause for rejection. System of identification. A system shall be used to produce permanent identification on the radiograph traceable to the contract, component, weld, or weld seam, or part numbers, as appropriate. In addition, the manufacturer's symbol or name and the date of the radiograph shall be plainly and permanently included on the radiograph. In any case, this information shall not obscure the area of interest. Example of system of identification as shown in the figure below. Monitoring density limitations of radiographs. Either a densitometer or step wedge comparison film shall be used for judging film density. Densitometers shall be calibrated at least every 90 days during use as follows. 
a national standard step tablet or a step wedge calibration film, traceable to a national standard step tablet and having at least five steps with neutral densities from at least 1.0 through 4.0, shall be used. The densitometer is acceptable if the density readings do not vary by more than plus or minus 0.05 density units from the actual density stated on the national standard step tablet or step wedge calibration film. Radiographic density Density limitations the transmitted film density through the radiographic image of the body of the designated hole type IQI adjacent to the essential hole or adjacent to the essential wire of a wire type IQI and the area of interest shall be a minimum of 1.8 for X-ray techniques and minimum of 2 for gamma ray techniques. For composite viewing of multiple film exposures, each film of the composite set shall have a minimum density of 1.3. The maximum density shall be 4 for either single or composite viewing. Density variation The density of the radiograph anywhere through the area of interest shall not vary by more than minus 15% or plus 30% from the density through the body of the designated hole type IQI adjacent to the essential hole or adjacent to the essential wire of a wire type IQI and exceed the minimum maximum allowable density ranges specified in T282.1. Example A single film technique was used to make a radiograph using a cobalt 60 source. What upper and lower density limits are acceptable for viewing if the density through the body of the penetrometer, IQI, is 2.7? Film density in the area of interest should be within the range 2.0 to 4.0 for gamma ray. Lower density limits minus 15 percent equals 2.295 upper density limits plus 30 percent equals 3.51 image quality indicator iqi design iqis shall be either the hole type or the wire type ASME standard IQIs shall consist of those in table T233.1 for hole type and those in table T233.2 for wire type. As shown in figure hole type is Conti and three holes. The smallest hole is 1T hole diameter and the bigest hole is 4T hole in the table T233.1. Table T233.1 for hole type as shown is consists of five columns. IQI designation, IQI thickness 1T hole diameter, 2T hole diameter, 4T hole diameter. Example what is the 2T hole diameter for an IQI designation 10? As per table T233.1 the answer is C. Table T233.2 for wire type as shown consisting of four sets, A, B, C and D. Each set contains six wire. The, the sixth wire of each set is overlapped so the table contains 21 wires. Smallest wire is number 1 in set A to the biggest wire is number 21 in set D. As shown in figure wire type is set C and consists of 6 wires. From left is the smallest wire number 11 to the biggest wire is number 16 on the right. 
as shown clear on the table. Example what is the wire diameter for an IQI wire identity 5? As per table T233.2, the answer is B. IQI size For welds with reinforcements The thickness on which the IQI is the nominal single wall thickness plus the estimated weld reinforcement not to exceed the maximum permitted by the referencing code section Backing rings or strips shall not be considered as part of the thickness in IQI selection The actual measurement of the weld reinforcement is not required for welds without reinforcements. The thickness on which the IQI is the nominal single wall thickness. Backing rings or strips shall not be considered as part of the weld thickness in IQI selection. Placement of IQIs. Source side IQIs. The IQI shall be placed on the source side of the part being examined. Film side IQIs Where inaccessibility prevents hand placing the IQIs on the source side. The IQI shall be placed on the film side in contact with the part being examined. A lead letter F shall be placed adjacent to or on the IQIs but shall not mask the essential hole where whole IQIs are used. Placement of IQIs For whole IQIs The IQIs may be placed adjacent to or on the weld. For wire IQIs The IQIs shall be placed on the weld so that the length of the wires is perpendicular to the length of the weld. IQI selection. The designated whole IQI or essential wire shall be as specified in Table T276. Table T276 is used to determine the specific wire or hole must be shown on radiograph film. By knowing the nominal single wall material thickness and IQI placement, source side or film side. If the specific wire or hole not shown on radiograph film shall be considered unacceptable. Example What is the essential wire IQI required for nominal single wall material thickness of 0.378 inches? On the film side. As per table T276, answer is A. Location markers which are to appear as radiographic images on the film, shall be placed on the part, not on the exposure holder cassette. Their locations shall be permanently marked on the surface of the part being radiographed when permitted, or on a map, in a manner permitting the area of interest on a radiograph to be accurately traceable to its location on the part, for the required retention period of the radiograph. Evidence shall also be provided on the radiograph that the required coverage of the region being examined has been obtained. Number of IQIs When one or more film holders are used for an exposure, at least one IQI image shall appear on each radiograph except as outlined in B. Below. Special cases. For segments of a flat or curved, ellipsoidal, turispherical, turiconical, elliptical, etc., component where the source is placed perpendicular to the center of a length of weld for a single exposure when using more than three film holders. At least three IQIs one placed at each end of the radiographed span and one in the approximate center of the span, are required. 
Geometric unsharpness limitations. Recommended maximum values for geometric unsharpness are as follows. Example. For a material thickness of 1.5 inches, 38.1 millimeters, the geometric unsharpness of a radiograph, when required by referencing code shall not exceed. As per geometric unsharpness limitations T274.2 the answer is B. Radiographic technique documentation details. The manufacturer shall prepare and document the radiographic technique details. As a minimum, the all following information shall be provided. If you notes the geometric unsharpness is not required. Practice time. Test yourself. Question number one. On what basis are image quality indicators selected? Answer is D. Question number two. When inaccessibility prevents placing IQIs manually on the source side of a weld being radiographed, what identification is placed on a radiograph to indicate that film side IQIs were used? Answer is C. Question number three. When reviewing a group of radiographs, all of the following information must be available except Answer is B. Question number four. The density of step wedge comparison film and densitometer calibrations shall be verified by using calibrated step wedge film traceable to. Answer is D. Question number five. What is the maximum density, in the area of interest, for gamma ray source radiography? Answer is D. Question number six. What is the cause for rejection of the B image on a film due to excessive backscatter? Answer is C. Question number seven. For material thicknesses less than two inches, what is the maximum geometric unsharpness permitted when required by the referencing code? Answer is B. Question number 8. Location markers which are to appear as radiographic images on the film shall always be placed. Answer is D. Question number 9. Densitometers shall be calibrated. Answer is D. Thanks a lot for watching and please waiting us for the next lecture.